Hi besties! Welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for being here with me today. We are going to do another Timu haul. The Moo, my favorite place to shop. Literally on there all day, scrolling around. Tell me I'm not the only one. Um, yeah. You know what I would love those if they would show me something different? Like I feel like I'm always seeing the same thing. So I hope you guys are doing well. Thank you so much for joining me. I am in the middle of a hot flash. I ran down the stairs and here we are. So let's just get right into this. I'll have all the prices, I hope, except for these two items over here, which I might start with. Um, I don't know why I didn't write the prices down, but I forgot. <laughs> but I think they, I, I think I know about the range of the price, so... If you check the comment section down below, I will have a link to uh, my cart, which will take you to add items to your cart if you want anything in this haul. Um, also, check the description box. There might be something in there <laughs> that you might need. Um, there's a link to my VIP group in there. It's free to join, so if you would like to join up in there, you can do that. And, okay, let's just get right into this, shall we? Okay, I'm going to wear these glasses today i think all right i'm just going to start off with these i bought the there's i bought i have two of these so when i got these i believe they were around 17 dollars each it's the same thing so i'm just gonna open one but this is how the boxes came so a little concerning but anywho these are solar lights and they're like little lanterns Honestly, they're not really little, to be honest with you. Okay, so it's these lanterns, and they're kind of like, I don't know, like rustic, kind of old school. But then this part goes down here. Okay, so there's like four clips. You have to clip right here. And then here's the solar bulb, and I don't know if this is going to come on or not. Let's see. I'm going to push the on button, and it, it lights up. So I thought these would be really pretty just like hanging outside very rustic looking very kind of antique looking i love the the look of this part i love that um but yeah so it does light up so at least i know this one works so i got two of these um so yeah i'm gonna put them on around my deck and a lot of the stuff on my deck is like that turquoise teal type of color so i love that color okay next is this item i got this for free um i think this was like a 53 gallon uh what do I want to, what do I want to call this? Like, you put your leaves, your leaves, your leaves and stuff in it, you know? Um, but it's like reusable, so you, they actually give you a pair of gloves. So that's kind of cool. But it's like a big bag. You get this piece of plastic. But it's like a really big bag. And then around one of the ends, you put, I believe you put that plastic and it's just like a big, huge bag for your lawn debris. And you can like, it's almost like the front looks like a scoop, but I got it for free because we have a lot of stuff we need to do out in the yard. And we haven't, honestly, we're behind in the yard work. So I'm going to hopefully maybe do some of that this weekend, depending on the weather. I just need to like get it cleaned up a little bit, you know, I don't know. Okay. I changed glasses because those were like bothering my eyes a little bit I think they're I think I bought these in like a 3.0 and I think that's just a little bit too strong for me so next I have these <laughs> and you're probably like why did you buy big circles of plastic well that's a good question so you can make walking path stones with these um so it's literally just like a you know a guide of where you can put um cement inside of it so this one was $9.98. Um, I don't know why this one was $9.98 and this was $8.48 because they kind of look like about the same size. But you just put cement in here and you make like a walking stone. And I had talked before about making a walking stone with like a print of a doily on the top. So that's kind of why I got these. But they had all different kinds of shapes and sizes. So like as you can see you can get like different shaped ones. But yeah, so I thought that was kind of cool. So you can, like, make your own walking stones. The other thing I thought is, you know, like I said, what I wanted to do was, like, put a doily. Or I would fill this up first. And then when the cement was in here, I was going to press a doily or something down on it and make, like, that kind of imprint on it. 
as a walking stone. I just thought that would look like really cool and like kind of vintage and antique. Add a little bit of antique to your outdoor area. I don't know. But that was my idea, so that's what I'm that's what I'm doing with it. Next is this item. It was $227. I'm getting styrofoam all over me. Oh, okay, it's just like a um something you can sort your items in. It's got a couple of little drawers right here, and then you get all of this area right here. I have no idea what I was gonna use this for at all, but I'm guessing because it was $2.27, that's probably why I bought it. <laughs> $2.27. I'm like, yeah, you know, I could probably use it for something. I'll use it at work or, uh, you know, in an art area or for spices and who knows, you know, like this would be good on like a little coffee bar because you could put, you know, stirrers and like little things of creamer and like stirring sticks up here or whatever you want to put in here. So yeah, maybe I'll take it to work and put it at the coffee bar there for two bucks though, two twenty seven. I mean, that's not bad. It's not horrible. I'm not mad at it. Okay, I got this item for free and it says, please handle with care because there's glass in here. So, oh boy, let's see if it made it in one piece. Place your bets, everybody. Place your bets. Oh, well, it looks like it made it all in one piece. No, I lied. It didn't. It did not make it in one piece because there's a piece of it right there. Uh, but it was free, so, you know, there's that. Um, let me, oh my gosh. Okay. Well, is there any other pieces in there? holy mackerel okay so this completely came apart um i have this this completely came apart all of this is broke dang it i could glue it back together so oh shoot well if i have all the pieces i can let's see if i have all the pieces that goes there and then i have these two which must go here so the idea of this was <laughs> oh boy okay so it it was a stand that looked like this like even these things aren't even this part fell apart good gravy so it was like this right and it had these holes in the top and then it came with these glass bottles that look like this I'm gonna try and put the glass bottles in here to show you guys but I mean I could always use the glass bottles so I mean it was free I'm not mad I'm not mad at it. I'll glue it back together and paint it and you'll never know. Use a little wood glue on it, but it looks like this. So you could put like bud, you know, they're like bud vases, I guess, or you could put, you know, whatever you wanted in here. You know what this would really be cool is like if you had a art workstation and you could put water in these and like dip your brush in them or different paints or something, that would be really cool. But yeah, it's completely broke and in different pieces, so... <sighs> I don't know but either way I'll probably just glue it together or I mean if anything I will use the bottles because I love little glass bottles for things next item this was 748 it's got styrofoam all over it 748 for this uh, no idea what it is I thought I want to see if there was a color or anything on it says gray oh <laughs> I thought this was adorable I had to have this I had to have this it's a little pig planter looks like this it looks like gray cement it's not it's resin but it looks like cement i thought it was stinking adorable i love it look how cute he is but yeah it was 748 i think it's super adorable like look how cute he is oh my gosh i love that wouldn't the succulent look really cute in there or i don't know anything honestly like he's stinking adorable i absolutely love this so but, I mean, I wish it was, like, <laughs> I wish it was real cement, but it's not. Which, that's fine, because then it just makes it lighter. But how cute. Oh, my gosh. Look at his tail. <gasps> no. So adorable. Look at that butt. Oh, my gosh. He's so cute. I love him so much. Okay. He's adorable. I love that. So stinking cute. Okay. I have to go get another bag of stuff, because that went, like, way too fast. <laughs> okay. So, I think a lot of this, the items in this bag were, like, under a dollar. So, I, I feel like I found, like, a lot of good items for under a buck. So this was 88 cents and it is a bag of makeup brushes or not brushes but sponges and applicators like the little puffs and you get 16 pieces for 88 cents. I mean that's crazy. Crazy. So you get 
like these little tiny sponges, which I love. Here's like four of those. And then you get a couple of bigger beauty blender size. And then you get a whole bunch of these like little, you get four of these little like heart poofs. Love those. And it's got like a little place back here where you can like put it on your finger and you know. So you get four of those. Then you get four of these, which I love these too because I start, when I start like, these are really nice for like right here to powder or take some sweat away, which is exactly what I'm doing right now. <laughs> but yeah, so you get four of those. And then you get two of these little sponges, which have, I mean, seriously, for 88 cents, all of the 16 pieces for 88 cents. That, that's a good deal, I think. I mean, you can't even get you can't even get this many pieces of dollar tree for eighty eight cents. No way in heck. Okay, then I found some of these little nail files, and they were fifty eight cents. So you get ten for fifty eight cents, and I use these little files all the time to do my nails. So I thought that was a good deal. And they look like this, and one side's you know one side's heavier than the other as far as uh sanding your filing your nails but yeah this is what they look like but you get 10 of them so heck yeah 10 for 58 cents yeah man and these ones are actually better than the ones you get in like the handmade nails they're they're actually really nice so speaking of nails <laughs> i got a uh set of press on nails these were 77 cents i mean what Okay, so let's take a look at these. They're like a cat eye. They're like a beige kind of cat eye look to them. Really pretty. Um, I don't know how well you'd be able to see them, but they're like a, kind of like a nude cat eye. Really pretty. Really, really pretty. Love those. But for 77 cents, I mean, that's a steal. But yeah, this is the little file you usually get with them. So those, the, these ones are much, much better. So, but yeah. So those were nice for 77 cents. Can't beat that. And then I got this for 87 cents. What? Lemongrass essential oil. Now I got this for a friend of mine because she loves lemongrass. So I thought maybe she could put it in her essential oil warmer at work. So it's just a lemongrass essential oil. 0.34 fluid ounces. Uh, looks like this. Really nice bottle too, really. I mean, that's a really nice looking bottle. Nice black label. I don't want to open it, but, you know, well, let's open it. She won't mind. She won't mind. Mmm. I love the smell of lemongrass. It's, like, so fresh. It's, like, that fresh smell. I love it. So, yeah, that was only 87 cents for that little bottle. And you guys know how much essential oils are. Like, they're ridiculously priced. Okay, this was four sixty four. It looks like it probably came from uh local warehouse because it's actually like a little knife and i saw it and i'm like i gotta have that it's pink so it comes in this little box and looks like this it says lulu boss on it yeah lulu boss but it's a little knife like i'm gonna be packing a little knife okay don't mess with me don't mess with me no look how tiny this thing is like holy moly how do you even open this i'm probably gonna cut myself Probably gonna cut myself. Don't cut yourself. So that's what it looks like. I literally don't know why I bought this. Like, what am I gonna do with it? I don't know, but it. what else is in here? There's something else in here too, but I can't get it out. No, is there? Or isn't there? I can't really tell. But this little thing right here just makes it go together. Sorry, the cat is messing with my ring light if it starts moving around, but I don't know. I just thought it was kind of cool for five bucks. I'm actually surprised they shipped it overseas, to be quite honest with you, but hey, never know when you're going to need a little knife, you know? It could be out camping or in the wilderness or something and need a little knife to, like, cut something. Never know. Okay, this is something for $1.07. It looks like a bracelet of some kind. Let's see here. Ooh, yeah, it is a bracelet. It's very tiny, teeny, tiny, teeny. Hey, remember this pink ring that I got a while back love that so there's that so uh, the reason I bought this was because it has the adjustable like this is like super adjustable so I thought oh good it'll probably fit my wrist you know so let's see if I can get it on 
And yeah, there's plenty of room here. So I like to be able to adjust it. It's hard to adjust by yourself, but it's just like a row of, <laughs> a row of diamonds. No, like CZs, really tiny though, like really tiny row of CZs. I don't even know if you could see them there. Maybe that's, I don't know. Anyway, let me show you on my hand, on my fingers. You can see it's nice and sparkly. And it was what? How much did I say this was? A dollar seven. But I like this adjuster, you know, because I have like bigger wrists. So, but that's what it looks like. It's pretty, you know. Mix and mix it with another bracelet. I mean, yeah, super pretty. I'm out of focus, ain't I? Okay, there we go. All right. So that was a dollar seven for that. Put that back in the bag, and then I got this. Um, eyeglass case because I have a million pairs of glasses for only 35 cents this was 35 cents and this is a nice case you guys I mean it's like a hard case you know it's a hard case it's got like a little loop on it it's got a zipper and then the inside is like lined so I mean wow 35 cents for that and you can like put your reading glasses in here you know I mean I love that and it came in a bunch of different colors. 35 cents? Heck yeah. I love that. Okay, then I got this headband. It was 44 cents. So yeah, this must have been like, I must have been doing some serious bargain shopping with this stuff. <laughs> like some serious bargain shopping. I need my cloud cutter. I can never get into these packages, but this was 44 cents. I feel like um, April from Menopause and Madness got one of these. And it was pre cheap, so I'm like, oh, I love that. But it's really, really soft and stretchy. Like, really, really nice. And nice and wide. And I love the print on it. It's a really pretty, like, lilac kind of floral color. I love that. Really, really pretty. Love that. But, like, 30, no, I'm sorry, 44 cents for that? Heck yeah. So I saw this, and I feel like they're, okay, there's two of these. Um, they were 387. No, hold on. I got two of them for 381. So together they were 381. But honestly, I'm literally gonna use these as decor pieces. It's like a little like date stamper, but how cute are they just to put out like a little vintage vignette with these? I mean, they are so stinking cute. Oh wait, oh wait, is there a base for these? Oh, there is. They have like a little wood base too. No way. So these have a little wooden base with them as well. So you got this little wooden base that you can like stand it up in. Oh my gosh, how cute is that? Like how cute would that be just in like a little vignette? And like there, here's this one with the blue. I love that. I don't know what parivion, is that French? Un dete timbre. I don't, I don't know. I'm, I'm just, I, I, I don't speak any other language. I don't know what I'm talking about. But how cute are those? Like literally just... For decor, I mean, so stinking cute. I love those. Okay, then I got these pens, and you're gonna think that is so weird, but um, they were 87 cents, but they are like weighted pens, and I don't know what it is, like when I'm at work, there's something about having like something weighted in your hand. Um, I don't, I don't know what, I don't know how to, so they're covered at one end. I don't know what this end. Maybe it's just weighted at one end and nothing at the other end. Because there's like nothing down there. But um, this end is a pen. But it's like weighted. So it, I don't know. It just feels it feels good. You know? So yeah, there's nothing at this end. It's just a weight. And the other end is the pen. So I don't know if they write different colors or if they're all... Let's see. That's black. So I'm guessing they're all black. So one end is a pen... And the other end is just a weight, I guess. But they say fashion on them in the center right here. But yeah, it's just something about having something in your hand that's like weighted when you're writing. I don't know. I, there's just something about that. But they're really cool. Like if you have like a sensory thing like I do, like I'm constantly either tapping my feet or moving my hands or... I don't know, I, I I touch a lot of things or I'm always, you know, my hands are always going. But I the feel of these is very nice because it's like weighted. So when you write, 
you know, it's like a weighted feel, like a weighted blanket. Like, I love weighted blankets and things like that. So, I don't know. But, yeah, I thought they were kind of cool. So, I got them. 87 cents for four of them. So, I don't know. Maybe I'll use them for, like, my Bible journaling and stuff like that. So, okay. Next is this item. It was 79 cents. Yes, I made powder eyeshadow. I made, I got some good deals going on in here. This is, this is some good deals going on. Okay, this is an eyeshadow. 79 cents. It's like by the, the uh, pop feel. It's kind of kind of like a dupe for... <sighs> What's that brand? Color Pop. So this is color number... Does it say? Um, number four. It's called Let Me Explain. So let's swatchy swatch it. If I can get it open. I'm trying not to break my nails. Although I actually glued this set on, so mm. these I, I actually have a, a couple magnetic palettes too, which is why I like to buy these single shadows because then you can get whatever color you want, you know, and make your own palette. So let's try and get this out of here. It's just not gonna come out. All right, let's just pull it out then. Okay, so here's like the inside of that packet, and then when you lift this up, here it is. So I'm just gonna swatch it, and we will let's see where should we put it here. So it's it's very light. It doesn't feel like color pop because it's just not as creamy. It's more powdery, to be quite honest with you. This would be a good highlighter, I think. You can even see it there. I think it would be a good highlighter. I I mean it would be a good eyeshadow too, but it's it's not color pop. It is not color pop quality. I will say that. I love color pop. I've always I've always had a special place in my heart for color pop. Okay, so here are two uh, spoolies for 98 cents. I thought that was a good deal. I love spoolies. I use them all the time because I do my eyebrows and stuff every day. So you get two, two spoolies and then this end is like a brush tip. And then there's the spoolies. But I always use, I use these all the time for my eyebrows because I color my eyebrows in every day. And they're also good for separating lashes. So, yeah, we'll definitely use those. Love those. But two of them for 98 cents, and they're really they're really nice, too. And you get the little brush, so that's awesome. Okay, then I got this set of socks because there's actually... Well, it says one size, but there might be, like, three pairs in here for 68 cents. 68 cents? And I love Timu socks, so there's that. But you get, oh no, there's more than that. So there's this pair right here. One, two, three, four. This is really cute. I like this one. Four. So five pairs. Five pairs of socks for 68 cents. Shut the front door. I love that. That's a bargain. That is a bargain, and I love to move socks, so that's that's amazing. Okay, here's more of those nail files like these, only they're black. Same thing, though, but these are 58 cents, so again, you get 10 for 58 cents. And let's see what's in here. This was 78 cents. Wow, guys, this is a lot of these items are under a buck. Okay, so this is some rosemary oil for hair and scalp, and it comes with, it actually comes with the glass dropper is that glass yeah it is so 78 cents for this let me smell it if i can get the top off here i don't know i honestly don't know what rosemary i don't really smell anything let me i don't know you guys it doesn't even really smell very oily rosemary oil for hair and scalp it's not very oily though it's like more like watery or serum and I don't even really smell anything, so I don't know about this. I'm just not sure about this because it's not... It's like a serum, but there's no smell to it. And I mean, I know rosemary has a smell, so... I'm not real sure about that. I feel like I kind of got gypped on that. Okay, then I found these hair clips. They were 79 cents for two. And they're stars. They're little stars and omg are these not the cutest thing ever look at that look at that i love these like how stinking cute like how cute would these be 
in your hair, you know, like a little, how cute, how cute, how cute are those? They are so adorable. I love these. I love how shiny and sparkly they are. So yeah, you get two of them and these are like a, I wonder if these came in other colors because this says purple, purple two pack. Super cute. Love those. If they have other colors, I might get other colors because I really like those. Okay, next is a ring. I love this ring too. I'm, I, it, it gives me, I don't know, I just really like it because it kind of gives me like antique vibes, but it was 98 cents and it's a cross ring. <clears throat> Let's see, I want to put it on so you can see it. I got it in a nine, so I must have wanted to wear it on this finger. So it's like a silver cross, but I love that. Hopefully it's focusing, but oh, I I love that. I love it. So 98 cents for that. Really nice. Really pretty. Love it. Okay, another set of nails. I've got this set before, and I think they're really, really pretty. They were only 63 cents. What? 63 cents. So you can see there's like they're like a light pink, and then there's like a gold, a gold one down here, and there's one with like a stripe of gold across it. They're really, really pretty. Um, I've worn these before, but to get them for 63 cents, here comes Kermit. He's nosy, but here's like the whole set, so I don't know if you can really see it or not, but I think they're really cute. And for that price, heck yeah, 63 cents, that's a bargain. I, this is some, this is a steal and deal haul if I ever had one. Steal and deal. Okay, here is probably another ring or some kind of jewelry. And it was 70 cents. Oh, it's definitely a ring. Oh, it's like a three-piece set for 70 cents? Shut the front door. Okay, so the ring is, yeah, it's not very well made. I mean, it's kind of adjustable, but it's it looks like straight out of a bubblegum machine, to be quite honest with you. Like, the, the actual band is really bad. That doesn't look too bad. But then it comes with earrings. If I can get the earrings out. And the necklace matches the earrings. But, I mean, it, there's a reason it was 70 cents. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to you. There was a reason it was 70 cents. Like, the, the metal on it almost feels like plastic. Like, it's bad. It's bad. Like, Timu has some bad jewelry, but this one's like... So, there's like the ring and the earrings. And then the 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 brace, the um, necklace is just one of these. So, I mean... This is the necklace and it's on a crappy, if you can hear, the cats are down here like wrestling. So that's what that looks like. Okay, so yeah, um, 70 cents for that and it's, it's worth 70 cents, maybe. I mean, look at the, look at the back of that ring. I don't even know if you can see it, like, it's pretty bad, yeah. So I don't know, I mean, it's obviously novelty costume jewelry. Okay, then I got these earrings, and they're pretty. They were 80 cents. Really pretty earrings. Um, they are like square cut, you know, moissanite. Well, they're not moissanite. They're CZs, but really, really pretty for 80 cents. Okay, the next thing I got is this. Um, it's like a put. you put your hand down in this to soak your nails off. So it was only 77 cents, but... If you want to take your nails off and they're like glued on, then you put some like warm water and dishwashing liquid or some kind of soap and just soak your hand in there. So yeah, that's what I do. 77 cents. So I don't know. I thought it was kind of nifty for 77 cents. Okay. Then I got yet another one of these guys. I don't know why I keep buying these. This one was 87 cents though. So I feel like for 87 cents, you know. Plus, I guess this just means I'm going to have to buy more eyeshadow sticks. But yeah, 87 cents for this. And the bottom does move, so it's kind of like a lazy Susan type of effect. But honestly, you could probably use this for a vase, too. You know, if you didn't want to put, like, all your stuff in it, like all your pens and markers or whatever. I mean, you could honestly put some flowers in here. This is really pretty. I really like the outside of this. I like the... the the way it looks so yeah I, I would use it as a vase if you wanted to you don't have to use it as as a container for other stuff okay then I got a whole bunch of hair bands um, there is 
how many in here? It doesn't say, but there's a lot for 88 cents. There's a lot of them. I'll bet there's 50 in here. Oh, easily 50. Maybe 100. Now, they just look like this. They're just the rubber bands, I guess you could call them. But yeah, there's got to be 100 in here for 88 cents. So that's a deal. And then I got this pair of, like, nail clippers. Again, 68 cents. So I think I was on... I think I was on one of those, you know, <laughs> a rampage where I wanted to buy stuff under a dollar. So yeah, you just kind of flip it around like this. Yeah, nothing special there, just a pair of nail clippers, but I thought they were nice. They've got, they got this like a little cover, so yeah. So those are really nice for like 68 cents. I like those. Okay, a pair of earrings. These were 47 cents. Wow. That's awesome. And I look like a back just went flying out, but that's okay. So these were 47 cents. Look at those. Wow. I love those. Heck yeah. Really shiny and shimmery. 47 cents. That's a bargain. I love those. Really pretty. Yeah, love those. Okay, another uh, pop feel eyeshadow. Let's see how this one is because the last one I wasn't super impressed with. I'm guessing all of these are probably about the same quality, but they're definitely not ColourPop quality because ColourPop is very creamy and very easy to blend. And these, hmm, they're kind of not. The other one wasn't anyways. So that's what this one looks like. It's like kind of like a coppery color. Wait, let me see what the color name is. I just threw the package over here. Dang it. Glass Bull. Glass Bull is the name of this shade. I don't know what the heck that means, but that's what it looks like. Let's swatchy swatch this one. This one's a little bit more creamier than the last one, but it's not bad. I don't, I don't mind this one. I don't mind that so much. So it looks like that. Again, very shiny, shimmery. It's coming across a little bit orange on my screen, but it's definitely more of like a coppery kind of color. So yeah, I like that. It feels softer than the other one. I'll just say that. Okay, almost to the end here. Two more items, guys. Hang in there. Oh, one's another eyeshadow. Okay, let's open up this one. This color is called Made to Last. 79 cents. It's, okay... This one looks like it's kind of broke, so I'm half scared to open it and get shattered everywhere, but it looks like it's a matte shade. I pressed it down, like, really, really hard, but this is what the color looks like. Okay, and let me wipe my finger off. Now, see, this feels very, very creamy as well. Ooh, it's a nice shade. It's really nice. Really nice shade. Those, I mean, for blue eyes, heck yeah. Really, really nice. So I like that one as well. The first one was a little bit, mm, but I don't know. I could just be being picky. Okay, the last thing is nail clippers. <laughs> I hope you didn't sit through this whole haul to see me unbox nail clippers at the very end. If you did, thank you. Thank you for sticking by me. So there's two, oh no, there's three sets in here, or three pairs, and they were only 37 cents, and these are heavy. 37 cents for these. So you have this big one, and then you have this one that looks like this at the end. I don't know if you can really see it. And then you've got like a smaller pair, but these are really nice. They're like, they've got some weight to them, you know? So for 37 cents, I mean, heck yeah, you can't beat that. So I don't know, maybe I'll give these ones to Brian, but 37 cents? Wow, you guys, that was a lot of items under a buck. That were like pretty pretty daggone good. So I don't know what the price will be now because you know how it is with Timu. They change up their prices all the time. These nail clippers are probably a buck fifty now, you know. So hopefully some of this is still at the same cost. But I will link everything down in the comment section. So look down there um, if you want anything that was in this haul. Thank you so very much for watching. I appreciate it so much. Please click the like button if you made it this far. I'll be shocked if you did, but whoever's here, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!